This video is sponsored by OneFootball. OneFootball app makes it easier to keep up to date with the transfer news, scores and stats in one place. To download the OneFootball app, click the link in the description. Long way for <laughs> a defeat, but I think as Newcastle fans we're used to it, especially at Wembley where we've got a good record here. What's your thoughts on the game? I mean... It's got a so-so game. I mean, I feel like we got, should have got a point from that. I feel like we definitely should have got a point from that. A bit of a mistake towards the end, but um, yeah, I mean, I like, was expecting this sort of really. I mean, we wish we had a point, but yeah, that's, that's it really. That point wished, but not got. Now, okay, we'll mention the lineup, but were you really surprised because we didn't really have much option, did we? No, I guess not. I mean, it would like to see at least Barack, you know, come along, but. Um, Almiron, I'm looking forward to. That's the main thing I'm thinking actually now. Is Almiron, you know, Miggy coming on, hopefully next game. Well, I think we needed someone like him to do there, but unfortunately yeah. we we're pretty much had said otherwise. Now again, would you? We're probably three, two or three points better off because would you have accepted three points out of these two games at the start of the week? We wasn't expecting anything from these two games. Let's face it. Um, so having three points now from these two games is amazing and then we've got to remember that and on top of the week we've had where we've got let's face it a record signing which is incredible let's remember that it's incredible we haven't had that in ages well 14 years which is amazing <laughs> to have three points from this and now looking forward I think we're going to do well we're definitely going to stay up I think from now definitely you're more confident than some of us there now I'm going to ask you who do you think struggled today do you know what? I, I keep looking at Atsu because I, I think he's got potential. He really, I, I think he generally has got potential to do something. He, he, he just keeps like trying these flicks and trills. They don't think it you know, comes off quite well, but he's, he's got pace. I know he hasn't got the final third. I know he hasn't got the final third. I know that he, he can't he can't finish. But other than that, I think I, I'm, I'm open for him to do better. So I'm disappointed in his performance today. I'm open for better. And again, it's a thing we were mentioning in the ground there, but when we're 1-0 down there, what we'd like to see is Hoxley come on as a second yeah. straight guy. Do you think Rafa is sometimes too stubborn in his ways and doesn't want to do that and just wants to keep it as it is there? I think I don't think he's stubborn. I think he's um, he's got a game plan, I think, in his mind, and he's trying to stick to that as much as he can. Um, obviously, some change, influence in the game is something that he's not doing as much as he should do I think that's what I would say it he hasn't got the players to do it though half the time which is one of the thing, factors let's face it when we've got like Almiron in and he's got the players to actually influence the game more than he can do with some players we've got now you would, you would think he'd be able to do it but when you've got the players in now I, I don't think he has the option to do it as much as he could do if we had more players well, again, if we look at it in the game against Wolves we should have the army back fit we should have Shelby we should have Key then we'll look at Dummett, Mutu, and even Almiron. Does that give you more confidence going into that game now? Yes, definitely. I mean, you're talking about some big players for Newcastle there coming in, coming into the fray. So I, I think <laughs> we've got a lot of players coming in and uh, from injury, coming back into the, uh, into the first 11. We should be able to get something from that game. I'm thinking so. Well, thank you for your time.